Okay, here we go. Total command. No way to get that choice ban on for the one shot. All right, you can Gardenia, but you're not going to get it. It's got one hit point left, unfortunately. It'd be nice to get a bench type here. Breath of the Leaves, heal. Oh, hello, the girls and the Frenchels. It's Nald. Welcome back to my kitchen. Ah, it's been a while, Nald. Oh, I'm sorry. I have to take some time off YouTube this week. So today, we're going to jump back into it. What I promised you last video. Oh, yeah, it was Empoleon. At the end of the last video, what's that? Yeah, we got Garchomp. We got to do that other theme deck Pokemon, which happens to be really good. So, Empoleon, you're on today's menu. We're going to cook up some penguins. Do the penguins actually taste good? Let's not try to find out today. So, Empoleon, uh, let's talk about you. Hmm. You're in the team shop. Everybody can get this card, and it's a pretty good card. Yeah, for two energies, you can get one in KOs. Oh, you're only one prize card. You got nice stats. Oh yeah, it's gonna be easy day today. So I'm gonna explain to you how this and Polyan deck works. Yeah, reasonable to build, and you're gonna see it in three way too awesome matches. You're gonna get really, 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 really close. So uh, you get it right there. Yep. So let's get started. Today's intro is something I just did today. If you are an anime lover, you will know what this intro is. If you don't, but you're curious, then, you know, someone's gonna tell you in the comments, so, uh, check that out. So, alright, uh, yeah, if you don't, I'll tell you at, la at a later time. So, that is, uh, well, let's get started. I'm Polly, let's talk about you. Stats. Stats are great. You're stage two, which means, hey, you have to evolve them the maximum amount. He may not be a GX, but they give him nice stats. So, 160 hit points. Is 160 good for a stage two? Yes, that's quite high. One of the highest rounds, catching up to basic GXs, along with others, and you're not a GX. You're worth one prize cards and choice man, the biggest, you know, form of damage boost, can't be used against you. No 30 damage against Empalia, but he can use it, he's gonna need it for that attack, so keep that in mind. Alright, you're tanky, you're stage 2, you tend to live about two turns. Yes, there are a lot of Pokemon that get one shots, but with the hit points, you can't. You can definitely survive uh, those normal two-hit attacks. So, first attack is his practically only attack. Although second attack is pretty darn good, but we, we, we really want to care about the big damage here. Total command. What does that do? Well, he's like a king, you know. He's the boss of everybody. Yeah, so every, every Pokemon gives him damage. All your bench Pokemons and all your opponent's bench Pokemons. Five of yours. You will put, uh, try to put five. Your opponent will... Not try to put five, but they can if they, well, let's say they don't want to, but sometimes they have to. Up to 200 damage, because that's 20 each. 20 times 10, tw 200. Now let's say your opponent doesn't want to put that many bench Pokemon down. Four, 180. Still one-shot KOs. With that choice, man, still one-shot KOs and choice uh, stage one GXs. And you can see even three is still pretty high. 160. Ooh, choice, man, you can still get basic GXs. Coconut Master still has to be scared. It's like, oh, please do not Guzma Meow. So, it is very high damage for two energies. And this is what stage two Pokemon needs. You're taking a lot of time to set it up. You should have a very easy energy cost. And this is why these stage twos are viable. Pollyon? All right, so we'll just see how that goes. Though you do have a third attack, which you're not gonna use. It's more expensive. You're probably gonna charge up another Empoleon instead. And it doesn't hit us high. Yeah, you get energy discards, sometimes that might make a difference. But you probably want another Empoleon to fight after your Empoleon goes down. So there's just not enough time to get that third energy up. It doesn't hit at the heart. Alright, so that's the Empoleon card. How do we get it out quickly? We have four of them. Four of this, four Piplups, we have one Primploop. Wait a minute, don't you need to evolve through Primploop? No, you can just feed it candies. It's a great way to grow your Pokemon. Yeah, feed a candy, very healthy diet, so rare candy, choose one of your basic, basic, and evolve it straight to a stage 2. So if you're holding rare candy and Empoleon, just evolve the Empoleon. You still have to wait a turn, but you can skip the print loop, and it's much faster, you just can't just drop it down, and that's one of the, you know, annoying things, but this is the fastest way to get it out. Alright, so really fast Empoleon, you know, you know, it's practically a stage 1 with that rare candy. But you need to play all four to make it consistent enough. And what else? 
You need some more speed. We need a backup attacker. And we're gonna use Glaceon because it's really, really fast. In fact, one of its special abilities that in its previous form, if you put a water energy on it, it immediately evolves. The Glaceon comes from your deck. You just search it in your deck. If there's one there, drop it on. Boom! Glaceon's up and it's a threat right away. Why? If it's in front, if it's your active, it stops abilities of your opponent's GX and EX Pokemons, so they can't play Coconut Master. So if you're starting turn one and you got an Eevee up front, uh-oh, they can't open up with Coconut Master and Bridget, and that's gonna be big. And you know what? It's very easy. It's just a lot of stats very quickly. It's a GX. That's two prize cards. However, man, 200 stats. More hit points than Polyon. But that choice bit will work against it, and it can attack very quickly too! Look at this! One water energy, one DCE! Two energy cards, just like a Apollyon. Really, really fast. What attacks can you do? 90 damage, 30 to the bench. Hmm, that 30 bench gonna add up! With that choice, man, 120, you're trying to go for two shots with that attack. And wearing down their bench line, this 30 does really much matter. Very, very much matters to Impalion because his damage can be, you know, very close to one-hit KOs. That 30 is going to help him out. Or any of your Pokemons. You also have your only GX here, which GX is something they're really, really good. You should have one GX that you can pull to, you know, trying to win the game. What does this do? Polar Spear. It's a multiplier. It multiplies wounded opponent's uh, Pokemon. So if they're already hurt, every damage counter is 50 damage. So, around the ballpark, you need about four. Five is death. Five, you will KO anything. Four, you will probably KO with the Choice Man anyways. Three, you can only get basic GXs with that. So, scaling is pretty good. Polar Spear is nice to get one shot. And you're gonna need that. So, those are your core Pokemons. The rest of the deck. I got my draw supporters. I got my trainer systems that I usually need. I've got one Aqua Patch. Because this one Uncle Patch can make the difference between, oh, I need two turns to charge up any Pokemon. But if I have this one Uncle Patch, it's like an extra, you know, I, can, I don't need two turns. I can just have one immediately right away or two Pokemon's charged up. So, I'm only going with one this time. I'm gonna, I really prefer two, but I really have a hard time figuring out what I can make that bench space. Uh, what, I can make space four. So for now, we're just gonna go with one. You find out a card you can take out. You can put that last card in. So we're not. This deck does not use a Bridget system. You don't have to use as many Coconut Masters or Bridgets. You will have to use more Nest Balls, which doesn't get them all out right away. But that's okay. Oh, uh, your basic Pokemon's out right away. Um, yeah, we need to talk about this in another video. But now I think I'm done. You know, explain to you and Pollyon. Yeah. Now you guys see it. Here we go. We got some sick and poly matches. Here we Awesome. That's a very awesome, awesome. Jen, welcome to another Impoly match. Today's giveaway winner is T Walker. Yeah. So, congratulations, T Walker. Let's play. I'm going to play my remix of Ultra Necrozma from you know, Pokemon Ult the new, uh, yeah, Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon. You going to live? I think so. All right. What do you want? You have to give up two cards. Okay, I'm gonna give up these two cards. I'm gonna play a Coconut Master too. All right, I need more cards in my hand, so what do I do? Oh, bro, and turn one Bridget. <laughs> yeah, Donald. Nope, that doesn't work. All right, let's go ahead and Lily. That was a lot of cards. We could probably should end that. Nah, I want to do this. For reasons. All right, that is it right there. Maybe we should have ended. Well, that's okay, that's okay, that's okay. So, leaving it be. This, you know what the grass here, are we looking at Galissabod? It could be. Alright. Now, he's gonna open with him with that big giant hand. With that big giant hand, it's like, no, I can't drop any basic Pokemon sound or energies. At least basic Pokemon didn't come down that turn. And, uh, well, I had a bad hand too, I had no draw supporters. This time around, yeah, but I just don't get that rare candy stuff. All right, so nest balls, you the man, nest balls, yeah. And then we see 120 damage coming soon, so it's kind of scary. Okay, so let's see what we got. Well, I can fit my hand significantly, very much so. 
Let's see how much, though. I might have to retreat you for now. Hang on. I think you're gonna have to go to battle, unfortunately. Let's get the Eevee down. Let's get the free retreat up, too. <laughs> Let's play the pal pack. We have no choice. Just to get a single Lily back. We need Banana Master. We don't have it. Didn't play a draw supporter, so we hope Banana Master pulls up something like that. Woo! No, I'm not playing in. Not now. He gets a big extra card pull. I'm not. I can't go for that. All right, we're gonna retreat. Choice man. I think I'll save it. I think it could go either of these cards. We'll hold on for a bit. So let's go ahead and use the energy drive right now. Take your first hit. Unfortunately, it's not enough to take out Zorua. And if it's these two, they'll, they'll two-shot me. I can't two-shot them back, but the damage will be significant. So, Pal Pad. Yeah, I hate it when that happens, too. <laughs> Pal Pad just comes a little too early. Professor Sycamore, you have to lose everything there. Guzma. Okay, Guzma. Yeah. It's like, I'm, man, it stings. I want to Pal Pad Guzma back. We'll just... Okay, now focus on the game. What's going on? Uh-oh. That Galissabot's charged up. It's got GX. They can GX one-shot me with a choice, man. Ooh, you got another free turn. Okay, so, in that case, well, this Sampalian is ready. It's ready for combat. We're gonna put the EV on here. Yeah. I mean, we're gonna get the SP on out. I'm sorry. All right, the only, I could end, but I, I could take a prize card. You know, this could get me later. But getting a big hit on something that's much more dangerous may be worth it. It may be worth it. So, let's send you up. And the only Pokemon that can fight right now is uh, Coconut Master, so let's do that. Now you can one-shot me, but I'm gonna take a, I'm gonna take a big chunk out of this. Big, 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 big chunk. You don't have as much damage. There's no bench space and bench on that side. You might be a little wary of that. Maybe just sticking with two, three bench space. Yep. Hands hammers. Boo. That's gone. That's good. That's good. Let's see. What's this? Okay. I don't know. Uh, it's, oh, I know the combo. Very, very familiar, good, strong old combo on the day. All right, under says try to stick with counter energy. It works unbelievably well. I agree. Yeah, one energy with total command looks pretty good. If you're on the losing side, it, it should be pretty good. Yeah, we should probably put one. I'm, I'm using uh, I'm using um, not counter energy, but I'm using a uh, aqua patch because that the kind of is the same thing. And to take Bridget, we have the new Donway to cross, but combos very well with this. And he's gonna use the GX. Yeah, the GX to run away. And the wing the crossbow. Yeah, I can jump at any time. Okay. Oh, man. Well, I'm stuck up there. I really don't want to see Professor Sycamore. There's no way to retreat now. I don't want to invest in this. I want to invest in this instead. I'm n I don't want to give him an extra of six cards for any reason. Let's go ahead and fill up our bench space down. That's all we can. We'll have to leave an exposed 20 hit point Coconut Master up front. We could have retreated, but... I would I would have cost the energy. I think I need the energy on Glaceon, or at least in Polyon here to uh, fight. Yeah. Yeah. Mick, Mick Jones, I came in from your YouTube channel. Thanks for the videos. Keep it up. Thank you very much. Oh, he acer roll at that back to full health. Oh, now he just needs a float stone to uh to do stuff. Yeah. Now he needs a float stone. And oh man, that that's big. That's big. Ultra ball. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Well, what do we got here? That's two prize guards. Uh who can attack? It's Zorak for the extra draws, of course. Of course. It's like, I lived! You didn't finish me off! You could've, you could've, but now he just undid that damage, and now I'm drawing card balls against you. Oh, that, oh yeah, that's life. Let's see. Uh, da, da. Okay. Let's see if he has the, the float stones. Like, I just need one float stone. No float stone this time around. Kinda lucky there. Right, Banana Master, you can be here. And I, now those extra card pulls will make the difference. So we're gonna go ahead and pull this out here. We're gonna try a GX. Yeah, we're gonna GX this. It's worth the GX. That will stop the card pulls, and I get the the battle prize cards I should get. So Polar Spear GX finish this off right here. 
Get the I'm no guy who gets the first two prize cards, so I'm now a little bit more vulnerable to end. Rare candy, nice. Hand lined up here, hand lined up. Hi, Junkie! Chat, Junkie's here. What's up, Junkie? Good to see you. Okay. Well, so that's what he wanted last turn, man. I was like, what? Don't know why that is there. And take a look at the card pools. It is Cynthia. Cynthia's here. So, take a look at the draw supporter seven plate. Three. Three. Now things are kicking back on. Now, infinite first impression. You see, the winning combo with this is you have to switch into play the same turn. So he's going to just switch, 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 switch. And it's going to be very hard to finish his Pokemon's off. All right, so what do you do? Yep. I mean, that's scary. All right, well, we got a rare candy. We're going to definitely rare candy one of these guys up. You're about to ready to attack. You just can't get the choice band. I need the choice band probably later soon. I'm gonna Cynthia because I may end up needing some cards here. Yeah, I'm gonna be playing the safer Cynthia instead of Professor Sukabor. A rare candy combo lined up. You're gonna give that let it go away? I don't think so. I don't think so. Hopefully I won't need that Piplup back. Well, that's the, my last card I can fill in the bench space. So that kind of stinks. However, I'm going to get a lot more... It's dangerous, but I'm going to get a lot more card pulls through this. Get that Empoleon up right there. Need more damage on this? Or oh, you need to save it for Empoleon. Oh, you're not going to live. Empoleon will. Empoleon will. That's maximum hope we can get full power with this. Awesome. Awesome. Aqua Patch. Well, you're, you're good and set ready to go next turn. All right, so we can only have one move to do. This actually stops, uh, this actually will stop Necrozma from activating, so that's a good thing. So I want to go for his main Pokemon. So let's go ahead and do this. We're not gonna, yeah, we're gonna let it be. So right now, Freezing Gaze is stopping Necrozma's invasion. It is a GX, and this thing blocks GX Pokemon, so that's there. All right, Ultra Ball. Right now, Coconut Master, everything else is being blocked. Yeah, what is this going to be? It can't be Coconut Master. I want to stop him. I want to say something. Oh, he didn't play it. There we go, he stopped himself. He Ultra Ball, he discarded two cards. I'm not sure if that was worth it, but he saved himself there. Two, two energies here. Ooh. Ooh. And the choice ban. So he didn't need that, but armor press. So now he's got 140 damage. Well, I got no choice. Well, I, I can retreat to this. I can retreat to this. I don't have another bench Pokemon. I destroyed them all. Okay, here we go. We're going to go ahead and two remove those things here. Because that, that gives them the magic. That gives them magical powers. 120. Four. Seven. I don't actually don't need a choice band to get a KO. You know, we actually need one more recycling card. It's kind of stinks how you always lose them. Wait, the rescue stretcher. That was last game. It's still here. Rescue stretcher's still here. Yeah! But none of these actually work. We'll save it. Let's go ahead and end. Everybody has less cards now. Got some energy. Oh, there is the rescue stretcher. You want to rescue stretch a bunch of cards back? That is worth it. That is worth it. Shuffle three. I don't need them this turn. Bring the Eevee. Bring the Glaceon. Bring Piplup too. That's bench space. You got another energy. What are you going to give it to? You got enough damage, right? Yeah, you can fight, but you're about to die. So I'm not sure about that one right there. And you need energy to scale too. I would save it on the Eevee, actually. But I need an energy per turn, so I'm going to put it right here. 140 should be enough with the choice band. We can still be aggressive and pull another card out. Here we go, Empoleon. I got the, got the, got the only, only at Glaceon in my deck. Let's go ahead and attack. We finish it off. Yes. All right, but you know, if, if he can always, he can, he can, he has those juggling capabilities. He has the juggling capabilities. We do not have another float to, way to remove the float stone, and he could last. He could totally last. Let's see. They probably did the float zones. These are most useful here. 
Oh, on the front one and the back one. Yeah, it's a good thing. Polly on the float, so it doesn't matter. Oh, two of them at the... Oh, double two removal? No way! Ouch! Okay. I lost four poker tools. I'm just gonna get rid of the rest of it there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Yeah, Donald, uh, Donald, what do you think is better, says Chunky? Garchomp or Empoleon? Garchomp has 200 damage KO. <laughs> and he has that uh, Lucario to help up out. Empoleon is just, uh, he's, you know, he's good, but... Oh, shoot. <laughs> yeah, it's, 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 it was your time, buddy. Okay, so there it goes. Um, well, the guy who has energy is to fight is this card, so he definitely is going out. It, it's two prize cards to two prize cards, man. Super close. This is my only Glaceon, so I'm not going to go ahead and throw, throw that out. We're going to play this. We're playing this instead. I think Garchomp is a far better. I don't have another thing to evolve this. The energy could go here. So that will, that will, that will give me some safety and another GX. Uh, a big GX to fight. Oh, well. Hang on. Let me look at my deck. I have a print blue. That's my left my deck, huh? Okay, we'll leave it be. Do I want everyone to have less cards? I think so. Do I need more damage right now? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I want these draw supporters. I'm thinking about sacrificing some cards, but uh, I don't think so. Let's do total command. That's all we have to, to do with this. Now, the scariest thing is Acerola, but that he's not able... If even if Acerola's, that's okay. This card has to leave the front, though. It absolutely has to leave the front. Free retreats. Yeah, we're gonna wait for a Guzma. Oh, God. two Guzmas and Palpads are gone, so this is why it's scary. This is why it's scary. There's no way I can get Guzma to finish this off. Yeah, bring the Guzmas, bring the Acerola's back. We have to take it at, take whatever comes out at us. The Guzmas, not the Acerola's? Nope. I just want Guzma, so I just need to finish off your Pokemons. Two Pokemons, that is. Professor Sycamore, ooh. Well, he's not gonna be Guzma. This is gonna leave the front, but there should not be another attacker available. There should not be. We are definitely in. I'm glad I didn't throw away the end. Oh, wait a minute. It's got the energy. It's gonna run. Wait, hang on. Are you gonna attack? I mean, if I defeat that, that's game. He only got 60 hit points. Yeah. Yeah, he's gonna save that, so free. He's gonna take the hit for me. Well, one of them. I'm gonna end because there's a lot of cards, and end doesn't. I got Banana Master. I'm good. I'm good. If Glaceon goes up front, then. GG. I'll put a smiley face because I'm not sure what. Uh, I've not even seen that. Oh, hang on, hang on. He's gonna leave that open for me. He's gonna leave that open, just let me attack. Okay, in that case, GG. Good game, you can see it from here. I'm gonna do this, total command again. He could have bought more time and maybe charged up back Pokemon, I think. Like, yeah, if he was playing full all out. But, thank you. That was a good game, T-Walker. That was a very, very good game. Very, very, very good. Okay, thank you very much, man. Thank you, thank you, thank you, and, uh, yeah. That's Empoleon. Not so bad, Empoleon. Thank you, T-Walker. Good game. Welcome to another Empoleon match. I'm going to play my remix of This Is... This is Jump Up Superstar from Super Mario Odyssey. And there's an error here. Hopefully my something didn't crash. All right. You know, that, that looks very strong. I normally don't expect that to survive. Let's see. We need you evolving. If we can switch to an Eevee, we might too. Let's get an Eevee down. Let's get an Eevee and a Piplup. Let's get that Eevee evolved. Yep. I would start off with Eevee for sure, so every single time. And we also get a draw supporter too. Let's see. You wanna you wanna play it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll play it now. I need more cards in my hand, and the biggest opening hand I can get is Lily. Yeah, it's gonna come out of sacrifice though. Hey, sacrifice. Here we go. I have to give up the rescue stretcher, which may help me later in energy. At the start, you don't need those too badly, so it's okay. You wanna go greedy with Banana Master or get another Piplup? 
I would be, uh, I wouldn't say Banana Master may end up pulling more, more draws, or if I get stuck or something. Yeah, if I can use the card from Banana Master, it's good. That means I get an extra card. Almost, almost, next, almost. Now let's go open for Lily. Okay. Drop it down, or leave it for another Piplup. Well, you can't get anything back at this point. Nothing comes back. I think we're good. Let's leave it be. This is a very good turn one. And I am very lucky I went turn one too with this. Because if he went first, eh, yeah, something, something be gone here. Okay. Awesome noob, are these, are these like the new Ultra Prism cards? Yeah. Wait, from the Diamond Pearl or Platinum sets? Uh, it's from the... Well, it's from the... That, yeah, it's supposed to be based on the, that era. Not the Diamond... Not the... Yeah, the Diamond... That era. Diamond Pearl. Diamond Pearl. I was thinking back and white. Oh, going for my poor Eevees. Well, we got a retreat. That's what exactly what I'm going to do. I lost my... Oh, I lost... My, uh, I don't have an Ultra Ball. How am I gonna retreat with this? We can take out Banana Master. And get a prize card right now. Or we can try to gamble and get him later. I need to retreat. This is my only good way of retreating. Got a choice, man. Better put it on, uh, better put this on you. Better put this on the healthy Piplup. Pow pad? You want a pow pad right now? I'm not gonna get anything out of that pow pad, so no. So let's go ahead and use a frost bullet, hunt that banana master down. I mean, if we can get three hits, or one more hit, we can get it. But if he evolves, we'll make another hit. So, to hit this Buzzwall GX. Yeah, I think that was the best way to do it. I could end. He seemed kind of stuck because he played end and didn't seem gonna play anything else. If we end again, maybe he'll get unstuck, possibly. Oh, yeah, banana master's gonna evolve. We're gonna take another hit. We need another hit. Or he needs to retreat this. Or we can just let it go. It's like, Sushi Master, he's like, Donald, how dare you take me out? I'm your chef, man. Why is this guy here? Oh, you know, I like Banana Master more. I gotta say it. I like him more. Sushi Master pulls. Well, that means if he gets one energy, Eevee's gone. He's gonna take a prize card. You could have finished that, and he would not have been able to draw. I could have, but I got greedy. Then he drew Sycamore with all that. He freed himself. Hmm. Hmm. And you could have got one extra card to play too. Ooh, but this card's gone, and that card's gonna come out and finish me off. That's scary. So hopefully we gotta evolve, and poor he gets a one prize card off this too. Yikes! That's not we we're gonna fight with this, anyways. Yeah, we were. Okay, we got a rare candy Empollyon. Perfect. Need an energy for next turn. Do you want any draw? Oh, you do have two draw supporters here. I wouldn't mind playing a pal pad right now. I have to worry about think about that. There are no Eevees, of course. All right, bench space, pal pad. Yeah, let's get some extra draws. And that's hopefully that's an end. Hang on, hang on. I get these two cards back in my deck. Two extra cards before we end, and we get something we can play, which is not likely. We got a float though. That's something we can play. Oh my gosh, I'm glad I have the 70 hit point uh, Piplup. Otherwise, he's to be dead. Okay, so I need some more cards. You need less cards. That's how it's gonna go. Okay, so what we got here? We got some. We got a pretty nice hand. Yeah, it's pretty nice. We got energy too. I know this may not be the right energy, but at least this thing can attack for sure next turn. And we need that kind of sort of guarantee here. I think I'll save the floatstone. Hang on, hang on. I don't want to play N after this for sure. So let's go ahead and evolve this into safety. Maybe not. Or we can just look, say, oh, I'll let it go, bye-bye. Get Print Ploop up. And you can't evolve? Yeah, I just threw you down. I'll fight with this. It should be safe. And it's gonna be hard to KO if he starts going for bench damage. Retreat, Bloodstone, I'll keep you. All right, now let's go ahead and Frost Bullet again. Frost Bullet, go for Sushi Master. We'll finish him off later. <laughs> if we, we don't have another bar, we're not gonna live till then, but uh, that's okay. Actually, I probably should have got for the buzz wall. Like, no, I want the sushi master. Let's see, recycling. We do. I think that Eevee's in the prize card. That's why we couldn't see it. Yeah, we have three Eevees. What happened to them all? 
Hey, one is right here, so the other EV is in the prize guard. He's got that, so... Do I have... Oh, yeah, I probably should have weakened this. That's like, I got enough damage to take this out. No, he didn't fill up his bench space. This guy a choice, man, so let's see. Four, it's two, you don't got enough for one-hit KO. Maybe with that 30 damage, you would have. You would have. GX'd it. Okay. He'll get a one-shot here, too, coming, so this has got to go. It's got to go. Oh. Oh, yeah, that 30 damage might have... Would have helped here big time. And he's not putting up any bench Pokemons either. All right, well, I gotta take a hit on this. Ooh, rare candy. I'm not gonna make that mistake again. Rare candy this year. Yeah. 160 would have been enough. Maybe. Maybe not enough. Hang on. Do the math. I still have Whirlpool. If I'm not gonna get a KO, then no, I can't do Whirlpool yet. I'm not gonna play Professor Sycamore. I'm gonna play Cynthia. We got another rare candy. Oh, well, we need this right here. At least the next Empoleon can fight. Water energy goes into the fresh Empoleon, of course. I can only use total command. Let's see. It's too late to think about this. 150, 160. No, that 30 damage would not have made a difference. He didn't blow the Hound's Bench Pokemon this time. He's getting close to winning, but... Let's see, he can attack again with Knuckle Impact. That's another KO, unfortunately. Lycanroc coming into battle was not good. No, sir. So we're gonna have to end this hand away. And then, then, then I'm not gonna get much out of this, but that's that's how it's gonna go. Are you planning to update your deck building guide too? Yes, it, I will, Doug. I will. Thinking, uh, thinking of the thinking uh, this weekend or next weekend. Yeah, yeah, we'll see. We'll see. It's like which what what comes first, Guzma? You want Goku to master right now? You want to get the... Oh yeah, you want to you want to quickly win. I see. So this gets this gets a one shot. That gets two prize cards. And with Sushi Master, oh, I should have not let you live. That means they'll save him from the end too. Well, now you know. Then he'll just uh, follow up. If he can, he'll follow up with a Lycan Rock and an Energy and win. So, well, Sushi Master, you got me, man. I learned my lesson. <laughs> now they get the sushi master. All right, well, let's go ahead and play N. Not gonna stop with the sushi master. One card. Let's go ahead and play that right there. Take away that float stone. All right, I'm gonna keep that. It's gonna be real tight. Two prize cards. All right, there we go. Really, really, really tight one. Like and rock. Yep. Go ahead and come up if you have the right stuff. Two energies. Oh no. Well, you can't attack with two energies. You're ready, GX. Oh my gosh, you had the like and rock? Shoot! No! You can't attack me though. Let me see how many goosebumps I got left. Well, he's got a, if he got another Guzma, that's sad. I'm really, really scared now. Oh boy, how am I gonna win this? I ain't got much, another bench Pokemon, I know that. This won't make a difference. But I need to think. I wish I had more time and it wasn't rushing me like this. Seven. Seven. There are seven bench Pokemons currently. That's 140. This is what... 140 plus 30 is... Oh my gosh, I'm missing it. The energy would go here. Or go for a retreat. Deal with this like and rock right away. Cynthia, you want a rare candy evolve and pull with Banana Master? Why would that help? It wouldn't. I need to keep my Guzmo. Total command. Hey, you could have gone for the Whirlpool. 
No, 170. It wasn't enough to finish the Reggie Rock. All right, if he's got a Guzma or like, and or oh well, the right cards. That's that. It's gonna be close. So I thought, hey, closest, the best chance I have to victory is to take this out. I think, yeah. Best chance I have a victory. Ultra Ball. Oh, he's got the pull. One turn too late, man. Ah, uh, GG, GG. That was, that was scary. Good game. Good game. Good game. Hi, Timmy. Pulls out the Eevee. Could have been. It could have been. It could have been anything. But then a master too. So outside the one sprayed. Oh, going for style points. That's a fell. It's he's not really. He's just bad. Good game. That was close. That was good. Not bad, Napoleon. You held on to that. I'm proud of you. I'm proud. Moving on. Moving on. And welcome to. Yeah, the very, very, very first Empoleon match of the Ultra Prism uh, series. I'm gonna play my remix of. Oh, this is the Leafeon. Hey, we're playing water, but luckily we're not. None of us are weak to grass. But uh, all right, this is my remix of Asgore from Undertale's. Here's hoping to another Undertale's too. Mmm. Okay. He's using grass, but these all can evolve. This is gonna be an energy shut shutting off uh, Grimer. I think. And these are all Leafeons. Okay, I see what's going on here. That means Banana Master is not going to be as useful if that thing comes out. So I'm going to start uh, working on more of this line. Here we go. Let's shut off your... If you do have GXs, I'm going to shut them off. There we go. Evolve into Glaceon. I, I should look through my deck. Now, because I really do want to hold on to these cards here, what is your opening uh, move? It's going to be... It's gonna be Lily, and we gotta get that out before the Grimer shuts out for Billy. At least that's why I think that Grimer is there for. It could be totally the actual Dark Alolan Grimer. All right, this is a great hand. Hmm, you know that's 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 what I think it is. I'm not gonna waste my bench space for that, so we'll hold off there. Ended right there. Yeah, let's go. I'm blocking your abilities. You can't use Breath of the Leaves, and I can't. You know, I actually have very few DCs in this deck. Kind of maybe maybe I should be worried about that. So, okay, let's see. Our bench spacers are getting pretty full. Maybe the real guy. I had to put the energy here because otherwise it would not evolve. So now, paying attention, take a look at chat. Okay, Silverlie, Silverlie is cool. Oh, what Pokemon works best with Silverlie? Silverlie works. Silverlie is everything. Guzma, Grand Bloom GX. Okay. Well. Oh, well, just let that happen then. Poor Coconut Master got switched out, and we will see what happens here. So, so one of them failed. It's Baby Zorark, and it is it is it is Power of Alchemy one. Okay, so we're not gonna. We'll see what happens here. First of all, rare candy. Banana Master is a waste. I'm not getting energies back. I don't have any super rods. And that would have been my super rods. Um, you want Glaceon to fight? It's not gonna... I think I'm gonna go for a one-shot on the Leafeon. Banana Master is a waste of space. Thank you, uh, Power of Alchemy. I'm not gonna waste the Guzma to go for it, too. Alright, let's see. We got another Piplup. Good. There's not much I can do here. I could retreat the Coconut Master now. But I can't attack anyways. And I'd rather Coconut Master takes the hit. So let's do that. Yeah, Coconut Master, take a hit for me. And we'll leave it be. So actually, both of us actually want a good bench space with this. So the Empoleon's almost up soon. Let me see the damage. It does 20 based on bench only, right? Yeah, so everybody needs a full bench. And I would need the help of a choice man. See, let's see. He gets the first attack right there. He gets the first attack. I'm going to have to follow up with the N. It's okay. Coconut Master's not going to battle. Like, actual fighting battle. Well, it could. You know, it could get a two-shot here. And with a DC, you can definitely do a lot of damage here. Maybe I should have thought about that. Hey, you still can use Polar Spear GX. Oh, I forgot about that. Yeah, yeah. You got the Frost Bullet, Polar Spear. Maybe not, but not so bad as a backup attacker. Okay. Uh, escape Rope? Oh, no. You're forcing one of my, I suppose, baby Pokemons out. Now he can't get a one-shot with anything, but it just means he gets a first hit on one of my Pokemons. Do you want to protect your babies or not, Donald? 
Okay, I'll send a Pauline out. Either the either the Leafeon's coming out or I don't know what Escape Rods play. The Leafeon is the only thing that can attack, and I'll let it hit me. I will let it hit me, Professor Sycamore. It's like, I'm not gonna waste the escape rope. Alright, the Empoleon is exposed. However, I don't see anything that crazy strong that can finish me off. Not even Zora can finish me off at this moment. So, there's a uh, 8 8. There's 160 damage. So, we need one bench space as well as one. Oh, oh we got the Bonding Bell, though. That would tub change his damage. But it went in the wrong Pokemon. Either he's got two or that he misclicks. Because that one's not ready to fight. This is the one I care about one-shotting. And I, instead of letting uh, giving away a prize card, I decide, you know what? Let's uh, let us let him take a hit. Maybe that was not a good idea. He doubled the escape rope. Okay, in that case, <laughs> come out there again, Goku the Master. You have the free retreat anyway, so you retreat and damn it, cheers. Well, I guess it is matters. He'll take two prize cards eventually at some point in the game. So, it's like, Donald, why you do this, man? I'm not gonna come for you when you, uh, I'm gonna be in you. I'm gonna start up front next game. <sighs> you know that's gonna happen. Yeah, but I need you to take the hit from me. Then we'll just retreat. My healthy Pokemons are, well, healthy. Yeah. Field Blowers takes away the Float Stone. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. So maybe I will just lose this, just lose two prize guards. Instead of one prize guard. But this one potentially becomes something more dangerous. Solar Beam. Alright, so, what do you do? You pay the energy to attack? I don't think so. There's a print loop. We need bench space. You can attack. I'm gonna go ahead and play N. If we pull the float stone, I can save you, Coconut Master. If we don't pull the float stone, that's okay. Bench space is filled. I'm gonna go ahead and get the second print loop available as well. And that is going to be that. I'm sorry, Coconut Master. We're going to have to give away two prize guards, but maybe we could make it up. Maybe we can... Okay, but this this looked like a mistake. Okay. So, let me see. I think that's... Is that all my Goosebumps? No, it's okay. It's okay for now. All right, let's see what he does here. He had a little funny moment with Escape Rope. Zora Arc, you're ready to fight. And with a full bench, too, things get freaky. All right, double ends. I get more cards. I had all the right cards I wanted in my hand, though. So... But more cards, I won't complain. Mm. I will not complain. We have, uh, let's see, take a look. Five bench is 100, not four is 180. So we need a choice band. 180, and we need a Pokemon. Let's see, do I want that Zorark or do I want to finish, uh, want to finish the Leafeon? Well, the thing is, if I give my full bench space, the Zorark can just get a one shot on me. Or you can go for the one shot. Nobody has a free retreat anyway, so let's go ahead and throw this here. Let's go ahead and throw the Empoleon down. Energies is easy to get. Oh, I should have rare candied. I should have rare candied because it's easier to do that. I just uh, just automatically dropped it down there. All right, I'm looking for a choice man and some basic Pokemon cards. Bye, Guzmas. I'll pal pad you back. We're pals. Yeah. Then you would have had two Empoleons, Donald. See, see, but this time around we don't have uh, we don't have the choice man here. We got this nice energy here. Let's see. If I'm not going for a one shot. Maybe I'll just send the. He can he could easily jump in with this and one shot it. I don't like that. Since I don't like that, I'm gonna use this to retreat. We're not gonna total command. Doesn't do enough damage. So let's go ahead and use uh, frost bullet. Frost bullet. Work on. I can one shot you, or maybe I can't. I'll go ahead and go for this. I'll go ahead and go for that right there. So now we can't rare candy the, those. Ew, and this won't activate. Yeah, this would have activated the super boost energy too. All right, Gardenia. Ooh, healed it. That makes a difference. That makes a big, 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 huge difference. Now I gotta find that choice man. And then we gotta we'll do something. Solar beam. Oh, man. All right, so what are we gonna do here? We got another DCE. I'm pretty sure another Glaceon to GX might be useful. Let's go ahead and do this. I'm gonna go ahead and play N right now. That gives me full card and shrinks his hand down. Gardenia, oh, oh, the Joyce Bands. The Joyce Bands. Good, 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 good. But now, the, the guy who can get the one shot's not here. 
You can't attack yet. You can't attack yet because you put the DC on here and then you forgot about that. Ah, choice man. Okay, I'm not I'm not about to give him another prize card. Better save it. I'm gonna save it. I'm not giving you any prize cards. I don't like that. Give you this here too. Okay, here we go. Total command. No way to get that choice fan on for the one shot. Alright, you can Gardenia, but you're not gonna get it. It's got one hit point left, unfortunately. It'd be nice to get a bench type here. Breath of the leaves, heal. But not enough to save you. Well, we'll hang on that. Hang up on that. 60 hit points left. Well, he has to do something else more too to, to do that. Well, he could retreat, do something again, but my damage here is pretty darn high. The next, say, we can just Prism Star. This is very hard to activate. You need three stage twos. Yeah, it, it was possible. It was possible, but you had a little automatic symptom where it's like, okay, I'll just drop this on. Jump in! Hey! Well, it has a one shot on this. That's what we were afraid of in the past. And then now my bench type is not going to get it. So, 160. Boo. All right. What do we do? Now the whole bench is completely filled, which is nice. We haven't taken a prize card yet, unfortunately. I'm not, I'm very scared that I can't get another Primplop up. You have two red candies left, okay. Might be still possible. Can't get a Zorark. I don't see a one-shot here. I don't see a one-shot. We got the rare candy. You need this to attack. I need the bench space filled for the damage. I'm gonna end again, shrink that card to null. That, that hand says nothing. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Okay, no, not got any more basics. So let's go ahead and test the nest ball out. Throw. Professor Sycamore is gonna deck me out. Actually, both both cards will deck me out. I'm, wow, I didn't know I was so low on cards. Okay, I don't wanna deck out. What's in my deck left? Where's the pal pads in my. Oh, the pal pads in the prize cards. All right, well, hopefully, you know, this is easy access to a victory that that Glaceon is. So let's go ahead and uh, get this up here. I do have enough DCs. All right, this is going to get scary, man. Here we go, total command. Take that out. All right, pal Pat, you need to come back here. Ultra Ball, not good, not good, not good, not good. Not good. Let me check the rare candy counts. There's one rare candy left. The No, there's not. Oh, yeah, the year is. The rescue stretcher is gone, though, so that, that, that makes it a little scary. Barely scary. Breath of the leaves. Heals. Heal away. This one's tanky. We can't like, take get rid of this. We don't have the two removal. What happened to the two removal? It's still in my deck. Yeah, but if I play Cynthia, I won't deck out, but I think I'm going to need that. I'm going to need that two removal for the KO. And this gets us one shot. I'm kind of scared. I don't need energies right now. I'm gonna Cynthia. I'm gonna Cynthia for that two removal. Okay, two removal's not here. I didn't check. I didn't see the two removal though, actually, so. We can't hit 240. I'm not sure what's left. Total command. Can't even take it down. I think our. I don't even remember. I have two two removals, but or maybe even one. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. This is scary. This is scary. Hi, K9 Games. Hello. Thank you, Mega. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Heals up. Escape rope. Well, I thought I'd give you a prize card. I'm not sure who to send out. If I send out someone who won't die? Yeah, let's not give any prize cards. Zero. I'll send this out. He sends that out. That is 150. Breath of the Leaves heals again. Crazy. Alright, this is close, man. I'm nowhere near to winning. I have two cards draws left. You have to win quickly, Donald. You're gonna deck out. I don't think I can win it that fast. Here we go. Total command. 
I gotta get that pal pad in the next pool. That's what the game's saying. You gotta get that pal pad to buy some more time. Pal pad, yes. Now hopefully there's energy left in the last draw. Hopefully, because all the energies are weird and split up, and then nobody can fight. Oh man, actually we have a two removal that could uh, we don't have the two removal though, it's somewhere, it's like that's gone, we just can't get it off there. Alright, please let that last card be an energy, please let it be an energy, please let it be an energy man. Oh boy, 50 damage, I mean 60 is nothing, but still. Alright, so we'll live. They're throwing you with the free retreat. Please let that last card be an energy. Any energy. Any energy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Pow pad. Pow pad. Buy some time. What do you want? Ends and Guzmas. And will keep me alive in the game. Guzma help me get a KO if I need that. Oh my gosh. Holy cow. Oh, thank you, prize cards. Retreat. Okay. What do we do here? We get GX. I don't need to GX to finish you off. That'd be overkill. Frost bullet. Frost bullet. Okay. He might evolve. He might evolve anything. I can't tell. But there's a rule out there, you know? Let's go ahead and do that. He still needs two prize cards. He just needs a goose, but this Glaceon out. That is two more prize cards. We've caught up. Ultra balls, choice bands. That last card's the two removal, isn't it? I only have one here. Holy cow. Holy, holy, holy cow. This game is this game's intense. Can we do it? I mean oh 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 he evolved it anyways. I know what my last card is. It's Guzma. No. Actually it might be. Well it's gonna be Guzma or N. It's gonna be oh, Guzma or it is Guzma. Guzma, it was a 50% chance. So we need one more prize card, huh? We got the float stone? Yeah. We can't G exit. Eevee, get out of here. Free retreat this. Oh, false bullet. Yeah, don't pull her spear. Do 30 damage to that. Do 30 damage to that. Ha 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 ha. Oh, that was that was that was intense. 1,000 damage done. MVP. Woo! GX for games this Patel. No, that doesn't. They, GX doesn't work for any. No, oh, yeah, I couldn't GX to win. I think. Well. Looks like you made it to the end. Thank you very much. So, let's, uh, well, it's time to we rate this deck. So let's get started. Alright, so, Empalian, let's break it down. What do we love about you? Your very good value. For stage two, you will be up enough hit points. You have a lot of damage. One shot KOs with that two energy attack. So, yep, five out of five for that. Mm -hmm. Next time, damage! We're gonna be you 4.5! Yeah, your scaling makes it possible to land chain KOs. Yeah, I mean, your opponent, you know, kind of has to contribute to that. It's a meta where Bridget and filling up your bench is really, really good. So, chances are, you're gonna land them somewhere. Alright, so chain KO and GX Pokemon. Even once, two GX Pokemon, you're almost there to victory. So, moving on, setup is a 3.5. I still have to take some away because uh, it's a stage two. However, you know, it feels pretty fast. You can get it out on your second turn. It only needs two energies. I kind of think I can actually bump the score, but stage twos, you know, they're not as easy as stage ones. You do have a stage one to pad you out, but Pauline's gonna. It's gonna be a little bit slower than other decks, just because it takes more evolutions, and it's a little bit hard to land rare candies. So, it's like every other game, you can get it out pretty quickly. All right, so defense. You do are you are trading some GX Pokemon's, but you know you can fight with all the Pollyans. There is the opportunity that you can fight with, yeah, these guys, and maybe uh save Legacy on for later. So to balance it out, it's not a primary GX decks. So your value with trading, uh, yeah, you're gonna you're gonna stay ahead a little bit ahead in prize cards, assuming you go against maybe another GX deck. Yeah, it's like, oh, I'm trying, putting as much effort taking this thing out, yet it's only worth one prize card, so we'll give you a little bit bonus point stairs. Uh, rating. I'm gonna give it a B, it's not bad. But I'm gonna spill the beans right here. It's not as good as Garchomp. Why? Your opponent has too much control over your damage. 
Garcha, they can't stop you from playing Cynthia! And Polly, uh-oh. Parallel City will nuke, will destroy you. It will destroy you. And Parallel City is very easy to play. And it's not going to be as reliable. Luckily, Parallel City will rotate. But now in the standard here, it's still here. So Parallel City is pretty overpowered. You really should have it in all your decks. It's really, really darn good. So, and it will destroy this one as well as other decks like Zora, Archie X and stuff. Ah, uh, okay, so, uh, that goes for, yeah, it's, it's ever, lots of decks weakness. Upgrades! You should, you should join the Dragon Tide. Just go with Guard Job, because this, uh, Parallel City is a little too easy to hurt this deck. So, we're gonna leave it as that. Okay, so, uh, anything else, Apollyon? You're not bad at all. I kinda like you. I mean, your stats are there, you, uh, you, you can almost touch the sky. However, yeah, well, that's where you are. So I'm gonna leave it as this. Pauline, you're not such a bad card. Okay, so uh, time to wrap this up. What is up for next time? Well, we did all the GXs already, but there's still lots of interesting non-GXs. And you know, if you go for one starter on Pauline, you gotta go with the rest. So this here is one of the harder ones. We had the easy, uh, we, well, well, let's put it this way. This is a stage two with four, three energy costs. And that's something that's not supposed to work, but we're going to make it work next video. All right, so leave me that. That's for next time. Yeah, so all right, time to close this up. Please like, subscribe. It helps the YouTuber out. I, I stream on Twitch, so uh, make sure you uh, check out my Twitch channel. Uh, follow me on social media. I'll give you clues when new things are happening. My Discord link is right above my head. As well as the ceiling. That's right above my head, too. Okay, so covers. They're on Spotify, they're on iTunes, I uploaded a new one recently. It has... Mm, doesn't have the alternate versions, because I couldn't put both in one album. Naming issues. I couldn't put like the acoustic version stuff anymore, they changed it, so... We'll probably do that another time. Alright, so that's too much information, TMI. Okay. Those of you who are still here are like, Donald, where have you been, right? Ah, uh, I have to give the truth out? You know, not so long ago, I was waking up at night. Yeah, breakfast was at night, and I slept in the day, and I don't like that. So, throughout the week, I've been trying to quickly change the schedule, try to put in a, a curfew of, you know, just try to stabilize when I wake up and sleep throughout the past years. I don't know if you watched my log or not, but I've woken up and sleep different times a day, and that's why I can't stream regularly. So... Let's see, let's do our best, let's fix that. Let's get everything together and... Yeah, not all the problems. So that's... Yeah, when you're ch changing your sleep so much, as quickly as I was trying to, you feel tired, you don't have any energy, so I'm like, screw it. I'm just gonna leave it be. Get off Pokemon, get off my computer. And that's... Yeah, that's what, what's been happening, so... Let's hope this works. If it works, you're gonna see me a lot more often, more... The schedule. The schedule. That's what something I want to start with. So, that is it for now. That's enough talk. So, Terra is up for tomorrow. Okay. So, that is, uh, yeah. Yeah, we can't be skipping Sundays. Nope. Not with the. Nah, yeah. Yeah, I do have something planned on future Sundays still. But to the Terra is tomorrow. So, that's it. No more talking. Thank you very much, Integrals and Differentials. I'll see you guys next time. Stay safe. Take it easy. Bye bye.